The year was 1902. In a little town in the middle of nowhere, there lived a little girl. She had no friends, tended to the animals on the farm, and never got out much. Well, one day, her father came back from town, and he brought her a doll. He said the doll's name was Susie, and for her to take very good care of her, and she would be her best friend forever. So the little girl took the doll, and she hugged it and said it was going to be her best friend. Well, they spent their days together, and of course they spent nights together. Well, one day, a new family moved into the farm just down the road. And they had a girl that was about the same age as the little girl in this story. Well, one day, the little girl was outside playing, and her dog ran off barking. She chased after the dog and came up to the fence and that's when she ran into the little girl that just moved in to the farm they sat there talking became friends the new girl that moved into the neighborhood introduced herself well later that day the father brought the little girl that just moved into the neighborhood over to the girl that's lived there for a long time and asked if maybe they would like to have a sleepover. Well, the father said, yeah, that would be fine. And he asked his daughter, would you like her to spend the night? She said, yes, very much so. Well, kids will do as kids do. They spent the rest of the day playing out in the yard, skipping rocks at the pond behind the house, and even spent some time feeding the animals. Well, it come time to get ready for bed. And the two little girls got washed up and brushed their teeth and got ready for bed. The father and mother came up and tucked their daughter in and told the other little girl good night and they both laid down to go to sleep. Well, the new little girl got woken up in the middle of the night to the sound of someone counting. So she laid there with her eyes closed and listened to see if it would just go away. But as she laid there, the room got more silent. And it seemed to have gotten colder. And she could hear 1,003, 1,004, 1,005. Well, finally, the little girl couldn't take it anymore. So she sat up looked around, couldn't see anything, didn't hear anything, and everything was quiet. So she laid back down and tried to fall back asleep. Next thing you know, she heard counting again. 1,009, 1,010, 1,011. Little girl clinched the pillow ever so tightly, wishing it would just stop. 1,015, 1,016, 1,017. 
If you'd like to hear the rest of this story, give this video a thumbs up. And if you'd like, leave a comment in the comment section below. Thank you.